what's up guys welcome back to the channel if it's your first time dropping in tommy kentner here and guys we're back from uh, dct world cup we had an absolute blast uh and like i said we stopped by Granite racing to pick up a transmission for the supra so we're kind of going to walk you through what we got for that and something come at ups today another part for the supra so we're going to jump into that i decided to go with the gte vvti engine uh, just because it well, it's the better engine or well, I don't know if that's true. They both, they both make good power. It's just what I was recommended. So I'm going to go with it. I got a built G. If anybody's interested, hit me up on Facebook, whatever you use to watch our videos, but I'll be probably selling that or finding something to put it in. But, uh, I went ahead and got the intake manifold. I caught it on a deal. Um, off Facebook marketplace that my buddy hit me up in so we're gonna do drive-by wire and this will let me add cruise control and everything but real nice solid brand new piece this is the fuel rail and then it comes with a clamp to work for that so you don't have to weld to the throttle body and then this big Johnny, it's like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> but and already the color that I wanted, super nice, super, super nice. But and it's for the uh, GTE. But I li we literally just got this in today. Today, all day. Uh, so, jump into the greenest stuff. Um, I hit them up on a whim, just going up there, uh, and asked if they had all this stuff in stock. And then I, I picked out another clutch. That was the only difference. And then they recommended the clutch I ended up getting. And Spirit of the 90s actually said the same clutch. So. I was like, well, if two people recommend it, it drives like stock, it's supposed to hold like 1050 to the wheel and drive like stock. So I thought that was pretty good. But they ma they manufacture their own bell housing. Got branch racing. Um, and then it comes with all the hardware, cross member, everything, all the bolts. Slave cylinder. Some stickers. Oh. Gotta get the stickers. Um, harness. More hardware. And then that's your uh, pilot bearing. Or not pilot bearing, but uh, I can't think of the. Clutch alignment tool? That's it. Clutch alignment tool. <laughs> it's a billet clutch alignment tool. Hopefully we'll share by one. And then I think this is your uh, hydraulic throw up bearing or release bearing. But So this is the, your dial indicator plate. Um, this lines everything up. And then I did go with the Tillet. Um, I think it was like a 265 or something. It's a beast. But it's, I went with their Tillet uh, twin disc clutch. And then dry shaft shop, aluminum, dry shaft, Kentner pickup. <laughs> <laughs> but um, But like I said, guys, I hit them up on the whim going up there just to see if they had all all in stock and they just moved to florida and in the video you'll see 
if you haven't seen it yet, go check that out because we kind of get a tour Granison's new facility that they just moved up there. But um, but yeah, so this is the plans for the Supra, and we got more stuff coming. Just wanted to give y'all guys a quick update since we got back. Um, been calling everybody back, catching up on a little bit of work that we missed while we went to the racetrack. But uh, guys, let me know what you think. Drop a comment below, hit that like button, and we'll see you next episode. Peace.